There's a very well-known study from the 70s. It's one of the native peoples of Liberia where they did excellent ethnographic work on these people's problem-solving abilities. And if you gave them some objects, cooking utensils and a pot, you know, other things that belong in a kitchen, you know, if you had tools you know, on, on the table and then a piece of meat, the people would say, oh, the odd item out is the broom because you use all these other things to cook. And they wouldn't categorize the way Westerners do, who would obviously say, oh, the food's the odd item out. Everything else belongs in the kitchen. But give them plants from the local area, they can very quickly classify them into trees and vines and bushes. So they can still classify, but the manifestation of that is culturally specific. Just to clarify what you're saying, there are cultural differences between these groups of people. But despite those cultural differences, there is within them an invariant, which you can call general intelligence. Yes, I am willing to say, you know, if someone presents strong data that there is a culture out there that doesn't have this result, then I'm, I'm willing to say, okay, it's not a cultural universal. But we need to see the evidence for that, is what you're saying. We need to see the evidence. It needs to be re replicable.